and the recording is resumed. Welcome to YouTube. Welcome to um, Monday night stream with Lord Jabu, Quietest of the Night. Bit of an update, as you can see, as I am, I've got a new model, new overlay. Uh, I could sure switch back to the chatting background for this because the game is presently not visible. Normally, I want to try to launch beforehand, but I was showing off my new, the new overlay and stuff, which I worked quite a bit to, to finish recently. Hold on, adding a stream timer. Although I should have probably should have waited till I made updates to everything else. Um, getting the game. Got to update the Twitch thing. I was entering the wrong word there. Anyways, we're moving on to Ender Lilies, Quiet to the Nights. Oh, that updated, uh, cooperated updating for once. That's rare. Anyways, oh, I should get on my controller before I launch the game. Sometimes it's fidgety if I don't plug it in first. Here we go. I do not know if I will make it into uh, into the least tonight because I still am playing this kind of plan. I think we're getting near the end though. Anyways, I can close that tab since everything's working fine. Let's get the game actually visible. I still have it set for Tinykin. Whoops. Oh, babe. Here we go. Anyways, let's get into the game. Oh, that is a tangled wire. See, last time we had just unlocked the ability to um, grapple. What am I hearing? Hold on a second. You probably That's a cat doing something. You do not want to hear that. Uh, there we go. Anyways, so we were doing gra we moved around with grappling and stuff. I clicked away from the game. That's why it's not cooperating. That sound. Anyways, so we were going around and recollecting things in every area. We know we can go back over here and the room we missed the grapple there. I might go get that real quick because we just unlocked it there from the grapple last time. Or we can. I don't know if we can get. I don't think we get the grappling item there. I don't know. I'm to be able to find. Those might be the areas we go for grappling now, as well, for new areas. Hmm. I know we couldn't really clear the rest. Could we clear the rest of the area? I think we need another ability beyond grapple. Or I just wasn't seeing what we needed to find. Anyways, we got up above there with grappling, so let's... We couldn't get the rest of the stuff there, as far as I know. I think we need locked doors or whatnot. So let's head down, get the rest, of, get find the stuff we missed in here, like in that room we knew we could get into, and then head down to the waterway, area and see what we can find repair at that room. Hmm. There is where we need to go. That guy. Who is in here? I, I pushed the wrong button. Hello, Remy. I make no promises to be suddenly good at grappling or moving around as we more blight we got so much of that last time then oh that was the only item remaining in here oh amulet gem that gives me plus 20. more blight 
Oh, this is how we get the shortcut. Chain of sorcery, always good. And that was the only thing we we're missing here. You can go check those pathways uh, in the room over there, I guess. We know we cleared this area as we got the boss last time. So it's, this is just backtracking to find stuff. Also, to create pathways. Oh, and also to take advantage of our grappling ability, because that is definitely a fun. It's always nice to be able to move about in ways you couldn't before. I didn't do well on that. I'm really bad at doing the mimics. Like I had to fight it. Why was I fighting if I didn't have to? Aha! Another chain of sorcery. Yes, please. What was the point of the... I guess you don't, don't need a point for every bit of grappling. Oh, but never mind. Oh, I thought that was a hidden path up there. I was wrong. Now I'm going to go back to a save point. We're definitely going to be revamping our relics. Oh, another locked room. Now we can go down and try and check out what we're missing there. Or the around, surrounding rooms, I wouldn't come back for it later. I'll go down first. I guess we'll go right first, because I meant to go down, but... Gotcha! Is it not above? It's probably down below, isn't it? I don't know items before. Oh, because all the enemies. And then, what are we missing here? Probably something that required the ability to grapple up here. Well, that's definitely a way to move about. Now we're we getting the items we need. It's definitely fun to just jump over enemies rather than having to dodge them. As poor of a job as I'm doing. Oh, here it is. Is that everything? That is everything. So go to the room to the left, and... I'll be able to go back to the other backtracking areas. This was not where I need to go. Oh, that was stupid. Oh, they all just kind of swarmed me there. Oh, we have to keep everything, so that's not a big deal. We got a lot there. There, all of that room there, which we can fast travel by. We and the room down below us. Hmm. Where can we get the stuff there? 
And we'll check in a second after we check our relics because we now have two more slots. Let's see. Selby, Max HP, Giant's Ring. Is there anything better to like increase SP gauge, speed up? Now, Blake, we already have, we already have you equipped. Experience, quiet movement speed, max HP, street uses. Uh, let's go with you. I guess you. Doesn't make that big of a change compared to where we were at before, but still a change. Uh, let's check the room below and see if we can get the line item there. Definitely starting out with a very backtracky type uh, run. Is that the only item? That was the only item? I'm gonna go quick travel. Why? I mean, yes, I could fight everything and level up a bit. At this rate, especially with the EXP boost on, we'll definitely get to max level for the end of the game. We have to backtrack to every area and find those stone tablets I was mentioning. Oh, whatever areas they're in. This is where the amulet fragment? Nice. And the amulet fragment, nice. And we're still missing stuff? Dang, there's a lot here. Now that's how I got the HP before. do with that lever. I'm confused. Is there a passcode here or something? Oh. That's certainly an Oh, there was something up there. Well, that's how you do it. You gotta bring all these down and then go up there. That's a new one. Yes, yes. And that's everything there. Return to spike. That went well. We have uh, 547. So we just uh, we have upgraded magic last time, which we still need 800 to get you to max, and we upgraded these two to max. But I decided to get the dragon to max next. I guess I did. Right. Yeah, it's kind of difficult at this point to say where well, I couldn't figure out how to get the across that platform there. Get the item the missing item. I really want to do that. I 
can go here for that room, but... Hmm... Go here. Oh wait, it's under the water, not above the water. It's like, where? What am I missing? It's been a while since I took this pathway. Huh. You probably could have gotten this with the wall climb. We could, we just I knew we I know we could, we just did. We were supposed to get it that way. We can go check the missing item down there, I guess. I'm gonna do that to get a blast of spite. I use that for quick traveling to the area by it. But we can explore up above here for a new area first. Might as well do that. Although I won't, I'm planning to get every item as time comes across, uh, I can, but it doesn't mean that I will get them all in the first go. Up, I think. I think it's here. I'm not seeing the means to grapple here. Oh, not like I could have done anything because it's a long throw, anyways, so. Can't do anything there yet. A lot of areas locked behind the locked doors, so we'll have to go to that new area soon. We're not going there like before. We have the mask we found last time, but that is definitely the end, ga end game area. Hate that thing. Pretty certain I killed it last time, so I don't have to worry about it this time. Coming up near the top, I'm not remembering. That it is. There we go. Gotcha! Now we can return. I seriously want to figure out how to get that.
What was it? Let's go there and see if I can figure it out. Let's go figure it out. Is it just me or is the it's the random gap here? There's no way it's just like you're supposed to get up a momentum just from to jump over since you can't. So is there a hidden path? And I never noticed that wall there. How am I doing that? I know how to take the to dodge the damage. Why am I doing that? And there's your answer. There we go. Fire and Plume. Slightly increases the height of your jump. Yes, please. Feathered ornament, silver bequeathed to her doting sister. Whenever once worn, crafted by a sorcerer, it seemingly grants the ability to harness the wind. More movement? Yes, please. How much do you cost? Or two. Worth it. I'm figuring out a lot of these rooms what I'm missing. I didn't. I don't think I actually did. I check out this area for a lot of the, this hidden stuff. I don't think I did. Is the room above this one? I can't imagine anything besides the grappling hook. Let's go check it out real quick. If I find out, that means I didn't finish. I forgot if I finished searching this area. I know I searched over there with the grappling hook. If I'm just mem not remembering, because it, well, it's been a week since I played, sorry. Feel that jump high. That looked like some but that wasn't. Definitely not it. Guess it's not on this side of the room. I, mean, I definitely didn't explore this area with the with the uh, hook. Yep. So I can go around. Look, I can check there. I can go back up there. That's right, I was just at the top and I just got a few checking with that area up there and then I was like, I'm done. Because it was late. That's uh, my bad there. I really need to make note of a lot of these things before I end the stream. Rather than just assuming I'll remember it. Yeah, that's what we need. We could have come here before. Because we needed the dash. 100 blade. And there's still something else here. Hmm. Oh, there.
Nope, we need a lot more dash power than that. There we go. And there's still something else here. So it's got to have a... Uh, Let's try not to die randomly while exploring. That'll get in the way of, well, doing anything in a remotely decent amount of time. We gotta fall down from above or something? I guess that's gotta be it because I'm not seeing anything else. the night. Oh. Pick up the decayed crown. I could have gotten this before. Enemies will be more easily stunned by attacks. Crown of highest royalty voted by the King of Land's End, having lost former glory, the Cape Crown was forsaken someplace far from the castle. What do you cost to equip? You sound cool. Three. Oh, here. That's saved, because that's another cool item to get. I'd like to equip it, but I kind of like this setup we have presently. The, to the room to the right. Oh, that, right. I couldn't... I almost made it, so I assume I could make that. I just get the timing right. try then I'll assume we require another ability again almost not quite yeah I do remember we did explore the rest of this area which didn't explore the area it came from now let's return to the spite and go to our to the new area here and check the room behind it, which is got a button. Go check that out first. Then we'll move on to the new area.
Hmm. I believe we unlocked the grappling hook after this room, or no, just before this room. What are we missing here? Attack me from below there. That's annoying. I guess, I guess clear out the room, then worry about trying to. No. Just get to take care of this guy. That could definitely make. I don't think you're supposed to make it that way, but you could definitely probably make that. Increases spear uses. Oh, we already got. Reaches our kills with a brudge of blight. It's been ages since someone has been able to awaken this ring's power. Eh, it's still useful to find. More blight. And that's everything in here, so time to move on to. Oh, we just need to do that. Definitely mimic. Oh, wait, ancient soul? Use an enhanced anvil knight. We can finally upgrade him. Again, well, third time, but still. Prisoner since become one of the blighted. Uh, I missed the last word there. Definitely nice to clear that area. And also, let's check out the spirit slightly increases versus increases, so a more powerful version. But yeah, let's uh, uh, attack up again. Always nice. Moving on. Yeah, let's go left first. I feel like it would link up with that area up there. Or somewhere else. Who knows? It does! I wasn't expecting it to be like that. I have a bad feeling about this. Big room, giant thing of water. Nymphalia's ring. It hastens the healing prayer. Ring grave with the name of Nymphalia, the White Priest of Dawn. It said white priests are born with a shining mark and blazing on their foreheads. Oh, I would very much so like faster healing, yes. How much does that one cost to equip, though? One? So that'll be equipped later. I have a feeling we can't use this route, though. I don't think we can climb this wall. Never mind. I don't think we're supposed to be able to climb this wall.
Nope, nope. Yeah, we're not, definitely not supposed to climb that wall. Let me try one more time, though. That was not the way I meant to dash, so I'm gonna count that one more time. I'm gonna count that as against my one more try. Yeah, that's not a. That's definitely a. Hey, you're supposed to not supposed to be here. Oh well. It was fun to do anyways. And we got a new item, so you know. Good enough, I suppose. Anything I don't care about having equipped right now. I decrease the maximum HP boost. I like to get my damage boosts. And my movement boosts. I'm gonna keep my HP boost switch out to be. Actually, we can increase our maximum HP boost. And go with that instead. Keep the defense. Hello there. The white priest is the fount. The fountain head lies beyond. Oh, this is a small area. This is not the new area. Flowers both blight and purify have taken root even this far out. Is this? This is it. My final purification. Really? What does that mean? Achievement unlocked. Benevol benevolence. Is that the end of the game? I don't think so. Well, we just achieved an ending from the looks of it. I do believe we just died. I've been watching all along. He tried to help. Just like everyone else. But this burden is not yours to bear. This blighted world is of my making. I brought upon myself. Isn't it tragic the sole purpose of being born is to carry the sins of those who came before? Truthfully, I wish you'd been born far in the future. Into a purified world free of blight. So please, I beseech you. Go and live of your own accord. No, that wasn't any good. I thought I was like, I actually ended the game somehow. The blight is being purified. Are you able to go on? The white priest of the fount is not only purifying you, Lily. She's attempting to purify the blight that permeates all of Land's End. Her spirit is gone, but truly her body must remain. I can't continue on past this point. Death is packed I made with the priests long ago chains me. Oh, this was an ending. Leave the rest to me. 
I hope you can fill the priest's final wish. For my part, I failed in those very same duties. Come now, don't give me that look. Our journey was one of many hardships, and yet I found solace in your company. will bring us together again one day. Until then, live and be well. End of the least. Truth remains in the abyss. Tragedy never ceasing. Ending A for that. I didn't mean to end the game, but it's good to see different endings. Do we still have that relic? Do I have to go re-equip it? Oh yeah, we still have it. We saw that room. That question lies, uh, where to go next then? Do I head down there? I don't think I can head up there. But that's a locked room, or locked door, isn't it? I guess our only option is to go down there. I can go check up there again, but... Yeah. Huh, you know. So if we're gonna do that, let's change we have to equip that mask. I'd like to get the XP boost for now at least. right first. Even with the mask equipped with this stuff is gonna hurt us severely it looks like. Now this is gonna be a fun area to go through. Is that stuff only that mask only helps so much. Oh, we can. It's. I'm ignoring you. Definitely much faster. Too. That's annoying. Like, is there nowhere else I can go? Is this legit it? I, I, like, like I said before, I'm right there, I don't think I can go, but I know that's a locked door. It's the only place I haven't rechecked. I think that's locked. 
I'm gonna go double check it. And then I'll just fast travel to the bottom, right? Um, one. So I'm not even certain that's a locked door. Because that's probably more of a collectible rather than a new area. I believe I'm actually in the last area. With this, yeah, this was just a locked door, wasn't it? I'll get to it first anyways, because it's not that big of a deal to... Head back up to it. Yeah. I did equip the mask, right? It's just protection again, it doesn't help us that much. Go to lab B2. Technically I've beaten the game tonight, but I'm not done with it. I've just seen an ending. Interesting. Hidden in the blood yet. Dragon Blade. Pick up Furious Blade times 100. Times 100. Yes, please. Still a bit ways off from being able to power up even our uh, magician to max, but oops. The room above is definitely a dead end with something hidden in it. Yes, yes, it damages me constantly. Let me get through real quick. pathway back up, but it was not. It was a pathway across? It takes us all the way up here. Interesting.
This is gonna be a bit of trial and error with a lot of death. Backtracking to get all the collectibles is going to be a pain. Go up, which leads to oh, back to that area. And the doorway to the left, and the door. Oh, more. Oh, we had to do that anyways to open the. So it's a multi engine type area. Had to come around to get here. And that fragment, always nice. We don't have to return to this area again. Well, we, we do, but not from that entrance. Because we got the missing item. And the pathway along. There should be another pathway out of here that I'm not seeing. Uh, I'm gonna go down since that will definitely lead to probably another the yeah, yeah, the definitely the other unlock, but oh go. Progress is progress, I suppose. Would it be faster to move up there and go through, or...? I think it's still faster to stick to this direction for now.
can't imagine uh, how speedrunners would get to this area without collecting all the relics and the upgrades I have. And then survive through it. dead end and it's a oh a safe space yes please definitely need you Peyton's archives four coming in contact with a blade of white priestess does not seem to spread the affliction thus I've collected a sample of blade flesh in the specimen for study our appearance is not all that differs from com when compared to standard blade flesh more shockingly rather than uncontrolled spread their bodies all but suppress the met metastasis of blight and its effects on the mind it's like any case of the blade of witness prior See if we can retain conscious thought into the afflicted. Perhaps I can bring Muriel back to herself? Yes. There's something hidden here. There's some stagnant light. Every time we hear anything about the priestesses in studies, it just gets more and more horrendous. Shortcut back up or something? It is. Here's flight. I need to go back down either way, but let's open the doorways. Healing. Boo. There's a lot of fighting through an area, more just surviving. There's definitely something hidden under behind this guy. As I thought. The path like couldn't be behind him as well, could it? It is not. Oh, it's still worth investigating.
from multiple of them here? Seriously. Take him on, bird sentry. This is not where I meant to go. They can move now? Oh, that gave me no benefit. Oh, nice XP, I guess. Can I save here? No, let's not gamble on it. Dependence increases damage dealt. Taking the strike from the blade subject to various experiments. Give them magical properties fashion to tool by a vertical sorcerer. Wait, just straight up damage dealt? For three, it just increases damage dealt. Versus slightly increases damage dealt, specifically on ground or in the air? Oh, that's a good item. Why did you not explode till then? Oh, well that's not gonna end well. Whatever, we can go change out our relics again. Let's see, first of all, see our attack is presently 194 with these. Giant's ring without you, it is 173. Uh, the ancient dragon claw, it is 173 still. One ninety. Hmm. We can't equip that simultaneously, although I'd like to. get this for more healing Can we get more we're getting or not I could just boost my XP I guess intake so we're gonna be slaying a lot of things get to max level faster minus three d uh, damage but that doesn't specify an air on the ground Where's the item I'm missing here? Don't worry about it later, I suppose. Ooh, I was closer to death than I thought I was. To pay attention to my health more. Yeah, 
something. Well, those deep things do a lot more damage than I thought they did. I don't have a lot of my defense boosting stuff as well, so... Chain of Sorcery! Yes, please! Totally worth it still. Down the area I need to get to. I get to because I gotta go unlock this pathway. I'm here again. There's an above area as well. There's the shortcut. Which is good and all, but that's still like. I'm out of heals. That was. did not go well. Cooldowns times. I found the missing item. Oh, we're at a crow. Gotcha. I may die now, but uh, you know, I still achieve what I need to achieve. I wish I'd gotten closer to, uh, to my destination, but whatever. I mean, I explored down there. We got one more chain of sorcery, which is very nice. Equip you, re equip the giant's ring for more damage or any health boosts. Um, how much damage do we have with that? 211. Versus with the 345 HP to 379. That's really only like at this point one hit.
Hmm. I could equip this. Maybe more healing. And also this for more HP, but over damage. Let's go with that. Actually, no. Uh, let's go with that. I'm looking forward to backtracking for a lot of the missing items in these areas. See, there's definitely something hidden in here. Probably hidden in the water. We'll see. I'm not caring that much about finding every item I can right now. I don't know if I would, but... Probably the most dangerous area in the game. I say after I immediately, uh, before immediately going searching in the blight again. Oh, it's an entirely different area. Didn't do that. Oh, I'm out of heels, that's why I was couldn't wasn't doing anything. Yeah, that was close, though. You're not going to find a fight. Let's go to the pathway we unlocked. Will we get an item or an ability to make resisting even easier later? Will that make backtracking easier? Probably not. It's a little pixel. This is the dead end, right?
Okay, we got everything here, so we can just go through the pathway. So we have the ancients did battle here, one final stand. That's ex that's implying that this is the end game area. Like just before I was born to the ancients, long ha have we both been around? The sheer amount of blight that overruns places is beyond the pale. Yeah, this is definitely like final boss territory. The white priests cleanse the souls of the afflicted through purification by taking on the blight in their stead. The white priests are born with a natural resistance of blight, but their souls are uninfected by it. Thusly, the blight cannot cause them to lose their minds or be driven mad. However, like the afflicted, the effects of blight on bodies still linger, causing the priestess agonizing pain. If the suffering could be alleviated, the burden on the white priestess would surely be lessened. I'm not expecting to win any final fights here right now. That's annoying. I really should be using my uh, dragon pod and building more. definitely not the final boss and definitely fightable. And since every final boss every boss provides an ability afterwards, we need to do that. Let's see, relatives some fighting bosses, we get rid of the EXP boost. There's something else. Let's go with damage. Well, at this point, we're level, what, 84? We're getting towards the... Finally getting close to the max level after... When we do go back to exploring, I'll... Put uh, both the XP boosts. Still in the invincib should have been in the invincibility phase, but not. And there's the final phase at least. How do I dodge that?
She does a lot of damage. That hurt me. Dodge that. He's not taking advantage of his ability frames, that is. dodge that. I think better than fast healing will be more healing at this point, but I'm gonna keep still gonna keep that on. That's probably the best. Is there anything else I can switch out that might make that fight easier? I don't know if we need this on at the moment. We did need that. Hmm. Defense doesn't think we could do the damage is definitely necessary, so what is good? I think this is probably, like, I can remove move and dashing speed, but that'll decrease dash it. Well, we haven't been much for that. And replace it with something like the, um, increase, uh, the extra spirit gauge. Was, was that two or three? Yeah, it's two. Yeah, that. If I take advantage of that, I could definitely dodge the spike, so I need to keep that on. 214, so that's like a, a 20 increase. It's, this is probably the best combo. Get enough height. Oh. One touch and I've uh, lost the majority of my health. A little more, just gotcha. We do not get anything from that. I'm gonna go back and save and heal. So let's get our EXP booster back on so we can work towards max level. That was too easy for a boss, I guess. Do 
It was all too late. Muriel, my assistant, I love her, lost to the blight. He never once laid a hand on me. You have proven firsthand that though the blight may trap us in an undying shell of impurity, it will never deprive us of who we are. I've tried countless experiments to bring her back to me, but it's all been to no avail. Thanks to my constant work with the Blight, the Immortal Knights came to being. And now, even the White Priestess suffers as a result of my work. Now that I've defied the King, sure I've been driven from my lab. <laughs> Truly, I'm a pitiable fool without you, Muriel. And yet, I must give up now. Until your life's work is complete. Not until we save the White Priestess. Please, Muriel, one day. Let me hear your voice again. Faden the Heretic. Manipulates Blighted to blast enemies. While slow, this deals heavy damage and can blow in his way to distance. Faden, head of the King's Mage Brigade, became unusually obsessed with the Blighted experiments after losing his beloved. He sank in depravity. Unlock. Uh, use the trigger in front of sealed doors. The magic of a Fane can open the doors sealed by arcane means. Finally, we've got access. The blighted bandit. Though its mind was gone, I feel as if it was directly protecting something. Achievement separation and truth. Mirror's blade letter. Please don't blame yourself. Prepare for this eventuality when I set out to say the blight. I want to tell you face to face, but I couldn't find the words. Please forgive me. There's so much more to do. I hope I can free searching in my stead. I'm sorry things added up this way. Faden Archives 5. My repeat experience produced unexpected results. I have yet to return a blade to its former consciousness. However, I have successfully created a new blighted from a test subject that retains conscious thought and the ability to communicate. I'll continue monitoring the progress by creating a blade that retains humanity. Have I unlocked the secret to immortality? At least the king will be pleased, so as I could call the substance wrong from the white priestess the deathless elixir. Though there's nothing I can do for Muriel, any trace of Hany left in her has long since dissipated. I don't know if we want to go this way at the moment. I think this might be the end of the game, like area. We're still missing an item here. I guess I can, guess I can quickly return to respite if this looks like a new area or something dangerous. Now that doesn't. That doesn't bode well, that sound. Selva's blade stain note one. The bone domain is filled with unfailable experiments. The air is so choked with blight, I can't even breathe without a mask. I'm willing to protect the white priestess of the fount. I'm all she's left. If I drink the elixir, it'll give me the strength needed to protect her. I'm just as I am now, as I've been, I want to transfer myself. I must for serious sake too. That is an unpleasant soundtrack, and we're waiting on going through here. This is definitely a post-game. We're collecting everything to get the real ending. Because we now have the ability to backtrack to areas and go through those doors. I 
Which we're not going to get through all the ones we found tonight, because there's probably areas behind them. Or the rest of this blight area. Pretty powerful, but only 40 uses. What are we doing? Oh, we do it. We well. Although it wasn't the best thing, definitely was useful to have the dragon. So many different quick travels. Anyways, let's go back to the very first locked door we saw in the game. As long as I'm here and doing stuff like this. While we're back traveling, what if we clear? We don't, well, we're not going to be there for a little while, so. We won't need the mask. Why does it do so much damage when it... I... At this point, that enemy at least shouldn't do much damage to us. At least we can one-shot everything. Thank you for your help. Huh. There's an elevator. Destroying the Aegis Curio. The Aegis Curio, crafted long ago by the ancients, holds the power to ease the suffering of priestesses who absorb blight while performing purifications. Its power has been weakened by repeated purifications by priestesses over many years. The power of an ancient spell can be used to restore this power and help the white priestess. If you can decipher the stone tablet, I'm prepared to restore the Aegis Curio. Wish I could do this spell myself, but alas, I have little time left. So this is what the stone tablets are for. And it looks like we have to return here after we find all seven. Makes sense, I suppose, to have the safe space be in. We could go there, but I'm gonna go to the. I guess we can go here next. No, I wanted to go to the bottom of the well area. Click. Oh, got Kelvin first. Wow, you do, you take a lot of damage. Ooh, yeah, that is a tough one. That's gonna be the opposite of fun.
Gotta do that. I know I should have saved that for the fight in there. Keep your distance and tag with everything you got, then you should be good. It's got one of the stone. It's one of the stone tablet fragments. That's why there's so much uh, health and stuff. It's protecting the one of the, what are the. I'm guessing true ending, will be what it's called. Items. Got you up there and up there to figure out what are we missing. Done in this area permanently. Seriously, what am I missing here? Oh, wait, there's that pit below here. It's probably it's probably on the other side of it. Yep. Finally found you. Besides that, there's just the entrance point. Anyways, feels good to be clearing out all the areas now. That one's gonna be fun, I suppose. I still can't figure out what I'm missing here. Nothing to read, nothing to grab. Oh, that would probably be across there. try. Then I'll wait till later and look up a guide or something. Oh, there's definitely something over there. Maybe we can get the wall from above.
Oh, well, we might need another ability to get bridge that gap, I think. I do believe there's probably one more airborne ability. I'm still gonna give it one more try. Nope. Where to next, then? We can go here, I guess. Oh, I, don't, I think I might be the other one that requires clearly another upper, uh, uh, like, up movement ability. That we do not have. an up movement ability we don't have. Will we find it in one of the areas that are sealed behind um, the locked doors? Probably. Let's go check the one here. This has a lot of rooms left to check out. Why not? getting more and more blighted. Like, the true ending probably involves curing that. King of the First Age Diary 3! The battle was long, but we have emerged victorious. Our attempts to find a way for our people to coexist bore no fruit in the end. The land will be divided into six nations. All over the land of the end, the land poison on me is said to be cold all year. As the summoners, the ancients still remain. There will be much hardship ahead, but as king, I must remain strong. Tablet fragment. How many do we have now? Three? Three. That doesn't give us the ability to traverse these areas and find the missing items. Some of them are just because we didn't come back and look that thoroughly after getting the... Ooh, chain of sorcery. Need. To do. Oh, that's what we missed. That's annoying.
I'll go back to that a bit. Like, I'll recollect the stuff later. I want to go through all the doors now and be see if we can get anything new, like, ability-wise or something. Hmm. I do believe that door's locked. Which is why we couldn't go from above. Oh no, it was just one of these. Snowdrop bracelet, great interest in damage received from enemies. Not just slightly, just greatly. What does it cost to equip? Well, we have the. This equips, that's four. We'll be equipping that later. Unequip you and you. I go with you. What am I missing here? to get more of the st uh, stuff you missed. I don't know what I'm supposed to do there. That might be more of a I'm coming back with a guide later moment, but you know. Up above for more items, but we're to later again. So we gotta go there, and I think it's and then down there. The so that's the that's that there's the locked room right there. I can't get to it. Might be an ability, a way to do it, I just didn't figure it out. Let's go here first.
Mm. Then I'm just confused. That means the only thing I can do is either go down to the next year, new area, or try these theories I haven't tried yet. We're backtracking because... Besides the fact I'm missing three, and I clearly don't have enough to jump or something, I don't know what to do. Because I'm going to treat... I'll go check out there real quick, see if I can make heads or tails of what the areas I'm missing there, I suppose. And then I'll just... Because I'm going to be wrapping it up soon for the night. Anything? And we do, but it's not really. I could shoot a max if I do anything. Hmm. I kind of really want to. Give this one more try before I move on. I couldn't figure out how to jump up. If I had the mask on, that wouldn't have hurt as much. Yeah, that's definitely requires something else. Which means all we can do is wait till we find that something else. go here and next and just set up so that next time I can go around and try to collect whatever we're missing before moving on. it up here tonight for um, the transfer over. That'll be wrapping it up here tonight for Angelis Quietest of the Nights. Thank you for tuning in for the update to uh, the change in my layout and stuff and new artwork. And also for watching me play through this, this very not so easy but fun game. We saw an ending but not the ending we're looking for. So I'll be continuing this next week. So tune in tomorrow night at 9.30 to 6 Eastern time for Art Stream, followed by Celeste. Then Wednesday at 8 to 6 Eastern time for the continuation of Tiny Ken. I do believe we're a bit of a ways off from the end of that. I don't think it's that short of a game. Probably in the two streams at least. It's not the longest game in comparison to some of the ones I play, but still pretty long. And tune in next Monday at 8 to 6 Eastern time for the continuation of Ender Lily's Quiet to the Nights. I've been Lord Jabu. I hope you had fun and I'd see you all again. So, with that, uh, hope you have a good morning, evening, or night. Goodbye, and I'll see you all later. <laughs>